Hey, welcome back to another spark test tutorial i'm going to show you on how you can actually put initialize git into your server so step one you want to make sure your file manager is completely empty go ahead and go down to startup and you want to go ahead and do this make sure it's like that then do master all right okay so now i get access token to get one you want to go right here settings Scroll down and click developer settings, personal access tokens, and you can create a new token. Make sure it has all access to everything. Click generate token. I blurred it for my uh, privacy, for my privacy sake. So you want to put it down here. All right, you want to make sure your name is the same thing right here. And right here is the repository, and this is the install branch. Now what you want to do, you want to go down to settings, scroll down and click reinstall server. Click yes, reinstall server. And as you see, it's in here, and you can tell it's right here. All right, now you might be wondering, how do I make it so where it will automatically update, or once I restart, it will pull my changes. So for here, I want to change this to this is a change and I'm going to save it. And of course, I'm going to go ahead and push it. Okay, as you see, it's pushed. Now we can go ahead and go to console and click start. As you see, it's right here and it looks like it's automatically updated it. Click file manager and you can go back to index and it says change. Just to show you that the bot is online, I'll put the screenshot up right here. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Peace.